No other team in Major League Baseball history has achieved the same success as the New York Yankees. And now the Associated Press has published a book chronicling the history of the sport's winningest franchise. New York Yankees 365 is a vivid photo retrospective of the team's most memorable moments, featuring photos from the AP's voluminous archives. 10 million images in the archive. I'm not sure there's a lot of people that could have done this. And, and I guess if you look at the behind the scenes stuff, there's probably nobody that could have done it. The Yankees are the one thing you could go to the start of the last century, almost to the start of the last century, all the way through the start of this century. And the Yankees still mean excellence. I think whatever the number is, 26 World Series wins, 13 other appearances. They average being in a World Series under every three seasons. People go, well, of course, they spend all the money. Yeah, but you know what? I can guarantee I haven't covered sports for, for two decades all around the globe. It's not that easy to win no matter what advantages you start with. In the book are featured the team's iconic figures, immortals like Babe Ruth and the Iron Horse Lou Gehrig. I think Ruth respected him on a lot of levels, mainly because he was the polar opposite in terms of personality. He was a quiet guy, and yet, feet for feet, I think, you know, Garrick was probably the equal. Uh, a babe maybe, you know, maybe wasn't as much of a power hitter, might have been a little more adept in the field, although for a guy that big, Ruth was surprisingly graceful. I think he just loved the idea of having somebody to relate to on that ball club or somebody close enough to him, you know, that that he could talk to and, and at least feel like they were semi-equals. And I don't mean it, obviously, in a... In just a, you know, I'm just talking about in a, in a competitive sense. The book goes beyond the baseball diamond with images that reveal the players' personal lives. A favorite photo in the book? It's the shot of DiMaggio and his dad sitting on, on a pile of crabs in San Francisco. That's where he, he grew up, uh, that's where he came from, and his dad could not imagine this guy would become a baseball player. And so that shot, if you know a little bit of the background, fills everything in, and, and that same page actually makes a reference to Hemingway uh, wrote in The Old Man in the Sea, there's a, there's a conversation in, in the middle of the book, and he says, they're fighting a, a game fish, and he says, well, would DiMaggio let this thing go? And he goes, no, DiMaggio would never let it go. And to me, that sort of, you know, in a way that, that gives you that whole panoramic view of the Yankees that, it, that I just love. And there's the most lovable Yankee, Yogi Berra. Berra was a small, really small man, you know what I mean? Not an imposing athlete like Ruth or Lou Gehrig, who's really tall, or DiMaggio, who was sinewy but looked like an athlete. Yogi looked kind of like my dad, frankly. He was, I don't think he was maybe 5'5", five, 5'6". Five, five, you know, he probably was listed at 5'7", but I'd be stunned if he was that tall. And yet the guys never had a problem sensing the, the desire that this guy had, or they never questioned his leadership because they understood you know, how much time he invested, how, how far out of his way he went to learn how to do the job right. The book's forward is written by former Yankees first baseman Don Mattingly. The sad thing for, for Don is that he arrived a year after they won the World Series and he left the year before they won the World Series. One of the few eras in Yankeedom that, you know, he, he was bookended by World Series and yet he was the best thing to probably to come see about the ball club. You knew he was in the lineup every day and for those couple of three, four at bats every day, you were going to get a serious professional, very skilled hitter giving you your money's worth. Over a hundred years of Yankees baseball, iconic, enduring images that are rich in history and celebrate the Yankee tradition.